Good morning. We're going to Epcot this morning. I'm buzzing about this. So I got up early and got us another Guardians. We've got Genie Plus. I booked Remy. So it's all exciting today. I mean, you're ready. So I'll go, go, go. And we can start ticking off our food and wines best. Because we haven't even started with that really, have we? No. I, I am excited for today. I think we need to go hard today and just get as much done as possible today. Disney hard. Yeah, let's go. The car park's dead here. Oh yeah, it's 8.15. The park opens for hotel guests at 8.30 and everyone else at 9. So we're actually really early today. We're on it this morning. Oh yeah, we're gonna get in that queue and get in there quick. I'm really Citizens of Epcot. You mad. We're in early. What did you just pick up, Vicky? It's a wine festival book. So it's a book that it shows every Stand what it's got in it, food, drink, and you can sort of tick it off as you go. So these queues building out here are for non-hotel guests. So there has to be a perk really, doesn't there? Monorail! So we're starting with the land. So in here we've got soaring and living with the land. Hopefully we can get both of them done before we get called for Guardians and then that's two more ticked off straight away. So they just changed Soarin' last week to Soarin' Over California but I'm not sure if you can still do Over the World as well. So we'll soon find out. That's Garden Grill. That restaurant rotates and has uh, all the characters in so it's a good meet and greet for breakfast that one. Oh there he is, Pluto's in the background look. Stand by five minutes. Living with the light. Life is a winding road, no telling where it goes. Driving through days and nights. Like the water. We're that early. Won't stop for the right traffic lights. All parts of this place. And I Loved it. Right, we're going on the Nemo ride. It's only five minutes. Very chilled, haven't we? Yeah, we have. Now we're off the Guardians, time to wake up a bit. Yes. So it's Guardians of the Galaxy time. Are you excited, Vicky? Yeah, I love it. <laughs> we're meeting Nick and Lee. We've just got to find them, but it's always good to meet Disney friends and go on the rides with them. Oh. We found them, they're here. <laughs> hey, yeah, there you go. This is the ride queue. Quite awesome, just for a queue. Lee didn't want to do this last time, but we've managed to get him on this time with us. Has the level of technological sophistication as the Star Black. Stop. 
Every time it's so it, smooth. Every time it goes round fast, my stomach just goes. Oh, oh brilliant. I, I loved it. I mean, it wasn't it. as bad as the first time, though. Now I'll probably try it again. It was the amazing. Second best ride in Disney, oh, short of yeah. flight passage. Oh yeah. Great. So we've done the rides, and I think it's time for some breakfast now. Oh yeah, I really could do with some breakfast. I absolutely love that. That was that was awesome. That ride. What are we gonna have for breakfast? Joffrey's big fat donut. So we've come to the Joffrey's booth at the beginning of World Showcase because the other one was longer than a ride queue. So this one's a lot quieter. Here's my wife got breakfast. with the goodies. So I got you a blue raspberry frozen lemonade. Mm, I'm excited to try this. I have a nice latte. Yeah. And Oh, I'm excited for this. Mm, two, three. <laughs> mm. That's so good. That is good. Nothing like sharing a donut with your wife. In Epcot. Oh, beautiful. Don't you eat oh. So this is our view from our little picnic bench while we're having breakfast. It is stunning, isn't it? Mm. How's your donut? Bang them. So we've just sat and had a nice little chill having breakfast. We've just been rearranging our plans a little bit for the rest of the week. So we've got some really exciting stuff that we've never done before coming up. Meeting some more friends. Oh, I'm so buzzing for this. This is like the best Disney holiday we've been on. We've experienced more than we've ever done. We've meeting more new people. It's just it's amazing. absolutely amazing. We love it here. I wish we could come more than once a year. One day. One, one day, day we will. Anyway, it's Ratatouille time. What are we doing wasting time? We're Let's get to going. See <laughs> so in case you didn't know, Emma absolutely loves Ratatouille. It's her favourite Disney film. She must watch it about four times a week at least. So, oh, I'm hoping that the t-shirt she found the other day is in her size. Oh, fingers crossed. Yeah, so. Come join us for Remy. So we're just coming into the British Pavilion and Mary Poppins is there greeting people. That's kind of cool. Right to we time. I can't wait to see Shay Remy. Oh my God, listen to the music. Oh, I'll just take you back to Disneyland, Paris. Oh, it makes me the happiest person in the world being here right now. Okay, there's the queue for Remy's ride. Remy's Ratatouille adventure. It's 70 minutes standby. Woohoo! 70 minutes and we got it on the Genie Plus. Well worth the money. 70 minutes. All right, we'll just go through the lightning lane. Vicky, what do 
what did you think of that? I love that ride. It's so immersive. You like, you actually feel like you're in the film. It's mint. You you got 3D glasses, so your 3D ride. It is just epic. I absolutely love that. What do you want to do now? I want to look around the pavilions. Oh yeah, yeah. Let's do a bit of shopping. So the only one thing that one in Paris does better than this does here is the restaurant. Oh yeah, because we ate. Nina Shea, Remy Walt Disney World. Yes, you do. Yes. Come on. This is the Ratatouille shop. I want this. Kitchen timer. Hat. This is a t-shirt I really want, but they don't have my size. Gutted. I already have that phone case. Oh my, it's all just amazing. That chef jacket would look great on you. You see the front? She is a chef, so she'd like to wear that at work, but I'm not sure they'd allow it. You'd look good. You need I'm that hat on over there yeah, to go with it. It's fine. Plus, the amount of stains I get down my way, you'd ruin it. Ruin that. So we're just here at the French Pavilion. It's always got such a long queue. So we'll have a look at the menu and see what they've got. Oh, the beignet. So it's a cheese donut, basically. <laughs> oh, croissants with escargot, snails, beef bourguignon, that looks quite nice. And creme brulee, it's in mimosas. Mm, I'll avoid this one for now. Right, so this is where Emma goes in all the pavilions and tries on all the different cultured attire. What can we find in here? Here's my Moroccan wife. I'm not sure. I'm not sure about this one. No? No. You can't give you that. I think it looks very cool in the summer. So the Greece one sounds interesting. Greek spinach pie, I can't pronounce that. Riddle cheese. Lamb gyro. I kinda wanna try that. I'm not a massive lamb fan, but mm. I might try it. So here's what that lamb gyro looks like. Does it make you want bread? Hmm. Yeah. I'm not sure about this grilled cheese with pistachios and honey. Mm. Maybe we'll keep going. Right, so we're at the Japan Pavilion. Vicky's just gone to get herself the teriyaki chicken bun. The rest looks interesting. It's just beautiful behind here. Look. You got your bao bun? Teriyaki chicken bun. That so looks quite cool actually. This is seven dollars fifty. Yeah. Look inside it. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, really nice. Did you have it before? I think about three years ago. Is it good? Mm. Well I like it. Yeah. Ooh, you'll have to let me try it then. There you go. Right, so we're just gonna have a little wander around the shop. So we're just gonna go into, is it Mitsukushi? Something like that? I can't pronounce it, but yeah, it sounds back by. See what cool, funky stuff we can find in here. It's not something we've heard of, like, it's all really funky, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, it's not something we're into any of this um, no, Japanese, Japanese stuff, but it's all quite it's funky. All really cool, isn't it? Got all like little Funko Pops and like, all the Pokemon stuff over there. Oh look, it's Animal Crossing's Emma. There's a whole Animal Crossing section over there. Emma spent half of lockdown playing Animal Crossing, didn't you? Well, you, you bought it for you, but I stole it. Yeah. Let's go. San. San. I found you. So just in the Japan pavilion you can get all sorts of different really cool like sweets and drinks. Pockies. I have seen in these in the UK though to be fair. Matcha. Matcha flavour. Them ones look interesting. These drinks look kind of cool. 
strawberry flavour. Pandas. A, a few bits of these you can get in the UK, can't you? But mostly not. $2.49. I mean, that's actually not too bad. They're about 50p at home. Yeah, but that's not too bad at all. How about wasabi flavoured peas? Oh Sriracha flavoured peas. Oh my, these wasabi flavoured rice crackers and peanuts. Chili bites and peanuts. Oh my. I'm not too sure this is for me and Vicky. We're quite fussy as shrimp. However. What is this? Oh my god, what is that? It's crabs. That's like something you'd see on Border Force. I mean, it's $6.49. And we can't understand the writing. Ooh. Not for me, Vicky. No, not me. What about yourself? I think I'll pass. I mean, all oh, this looks a little bit... Um, Interesting. Yeah. If anyone knows what this is, please let us know. Unique. And then there's some Japanese wine and spirits. Really, really interesting. So up there is Teppanido. It's one of the Japanese restaurants. Apparently, it's amazing. Uh, we've seen many of vlogs, haven't we, on it? But yeah, it's where they chop it up on like a skillet. <laughs> pop into the art of Disney. Last year on our honeymoon we did get a few bits of art so we'd like to add to it this year. Oh my, B Vicky, look at that stife of Mickey and Minnie. Oh wow. Oh my god, they're amazing. So it's $79.99 for the Minnie and $79.99 for the Mickey. Whoa. We're making a purchase. This is so cool. We got some of these on our honeymoon last year, this style, didn't we? Yeah. They're about, it doesn't have a price on that one, but they were about 49.99, but we've got them all the way up the stairs. Well, when I say all the way, we've got three, so we'll- We need more. Yeah, we'll definitely add to it. This kind of thing, when you find it, you need to buy it, because we found some thinking, oh, we'll get a few later on the trip last year, and then a lot of the ones we wanted, we can find again. So if you see it, buy it. The actual artwork in frames in here is, is just amazing. I'd love to be able to ship some of it home. Oh, I love that one. It's 399 pound, that one. Dollars, sorry. I love the big one behind. That would look nice on the stairs, the big Mickey. That is $7,000. Wow. These are beautiful. These are the Thomas T. Kincaid ones. We've got some of these in a in a print. They're thousand dollars that one in a frame. Okay, so artwork purchased. It was forty four ninety nine, which made it forty seven ninety one plus tax. The great thing about that is, is obviously you want, don't want to carry it around with you while you're on the rides. So you can actually leave it in the store for after being purchased and collect it by seven. Um, 7 or oh, 8 45 before it closes so that's great for the fact that we're just going to go on a few more rides so we'll must remember to go collect that later on we just stopped at the fife and drum tavern vicky just wants to pick up her blueberry slushy right she's got her frozen fanta slushy it's a standard we have many a times on a trip just a good refresher it is and it's quite warm today this yeah sun keeps going in and out but it is warm. Real humid. Yeah, real humid. So if this is the Eat to the Beat where you can watch a concert. Some pretty cool people on there this month. So that will kick off later on. You can watch from here or try and get closer, but it's not very easy to get down there. This is beautiful. This is just outside the American Pavilion, this Eat to the Beat eat to the beat even. Have you seen Vicky? That shirt's really cool. Oh my god, look. 
That's really cool. I could definitely see you in that. Oh my, look at these ears, Vicky. They're cool. I've seen these Gucci bags. Did you ask how much it was, Vicky? No, but the bottom was $1,550. So $1,550 for the Huey, Dewey and Louie and Donald. I know you want the Mickey Mouse one. Yeah, I'm getting used to the same. Mm. Stop spending now for the rest of the trip and you can have it. So the Italy booth has got some really interesting things. So last year they had chicken strips with a, a like pizza sauce and they were amazing. <laughs> this is the Germany area. <laughs> this is where... You'll find more stuff bears in here. Oh, this is where we got our mini and Mickey Stife teddy bear last year. So the Caramel Coos shop is where the original sweet shop. We'll definitely pop in there to have a look at them, won't we? Because you all have one. Yeah, I'll have one. This is really cool. Oh, there's a restaurant there. We're going in the shop, Vicky. Hmm. It's a Christmas corner. Oh my God, the smell from the Weather original shop. That's amazing. A pickle ornament. Yes, pickle. Oh my. I love the Stife stuff. Oh my, it's here, Vicky. There's a very small chance I might go back with these. Look at the Mickey holding a teddy and the mini. Oh my God. They're 79.99 each. Oh my. Oh, I love them so much. So in each pavilion, they've got a lot of merchandise, obviously with Mickey Mini in, but from those countries. And uh, this Germany stuff's really cool. Hello. What's yeah. the chances I might get this diced teddy bear? Quite high. How good have I got to be? See if we find your glasses first. <laughs> what is that? It's just a tub of caramel. This, this place, like, it smells amazing. I mean, Weather's Original is not something I personally pick. Whoa. However, I know Vicky likes it. Caramel dessert. Right, so we're at the Alps Pavilion, and there's something I really want on here. It's Gordon dark Christmas. chocolate fondant. Mum, mum, mm -hmm. recording for us. What have you got here? Fondue. So it's warm chocolate fondue, and my wang, berries, and little pieces of cake. This is like five dollars fifty. I mean, that is unreal. Let's give it a go. Don't spill that. <laughs> That's amazing. Is it everything you wanted? I need another one of these at some point in history. There's two amazing things about this. One, it was amazing. And it's also, the second thing was amazing. I didn't spill it down me. <laughs> and I always spill things down me. That was the best thing I've eaten in Disney's Food and Wine Festival, by far. I feel like I've died and gone to heaven. <laughs> that was divine, absolutely divine. I will be having that again, this trip. Don't really care for the blueberries. Raspberries, whichever, no, blueberries. Don't really care for the blueberries, but amazing. Very uh, strong smell here. Oh, I had that last year, didn't I? The chicken tikka masala. It wasn't very memorable. So we're just at the China area. This is just beautiful. I mean, everything about Epcot is beautiful, but this really is beautiful. You can go in there and watch a show, can't you? Yeah. Should we go down to the shop down here? Oh, yeah. Time to try on. Oh, I like this outfit. We're in the China shop. Brings back memories, this one, Vicky. 
So you can even get Chinese outfits for your little dog. I mean, I'm not sure Pluto would look alright in it, but how cool! Is I that? think he would hate us if we put him in something like this. Twenty one ninety five. That is really cool. Okay, the dog would go mad. Poor little sausage. But they've got actual jumpers. Oh, she's found something. What has she found? He could match me. Yeah, he could. Shall we get? Shall we get you a matching outfit? Oh my, I love that. Oh, that's a cat one. Well, he's as small as a cat. That is really cool. Um, he does actually not mind clothes, but maybe not that. All right, we've been into the Chinese area. I absolutely love trying them on. I actually really want one of them things. I, I forgot what they're called, but like the kimono, whatever they are, I really love all that stuff. I was actually born in Hong Kong, so I feel like I'm back to my roots. But she won't let me have one. You can have one for me. This is just beautiful. So I believe Epcot Ball is just behind that tree. Oh, it's nice taking it all in today, I tell you. Just loving my life. Right, so at the China Pavilion, the chicken dumplings look good. She's just gone to order a crispy duck bao bun, and the noodles look good as well. Hmm, I like all them free. Right, so Vicky's got the crispy duck bao bun, which was $8.25 from China. This yeah. is top of my food and wine list. This. Good? Good. Oh my god, that was everything I wanted it to be. If you like duck, get it. That was... It had, had oh. like a hoisin sauce in it. She did let me have a little mouthful. That was divine. I'd say that second to the fondue, but that was the best thing in... Best non dessert thing. Oh, amazing. That was 100% banging. The only problem is it was a bit small we could have done with it bigger but it means i'll just have to go buy more right we're on to norway now oh, i love the norway shop so this is the queue for the frozen ride at the back of norway there is the frozen ride entrance it's a 40 minute standby but we've got a, a genie plus for it later so yeah. we'll go on that one later on i lied it's 80 minutes for the standby entrance there's the queue Thank God we've got this Genie Plus. Yes. It's well worth it. The $17 we paid for it? Yeah, $17 each. Even if we only do the Ratatouille and this, they're the longest wait times in yeah, Epcot. So I'm happy with that. Oh yeah, 80 minutes. I'm not standing there for 80 minutes. We've got food to eat. Yeah. So uh, we've got that like 3.30 or something? Something like that? Something like that. So we'll, we'll carry on doing a little bit more eating, shopping, and then come back for that soon. So we're in the Norway shop now. This is where you, can, you come off of the exit of the ride of the Frozen Ride. So here's the exit of the Frozen Ride and it takes you into the shop. There's a lot of Heli Hansen in here. Vicky brought herself a Heli Hansen Mickey Mouse jacket last year. She absolutely loves it. This is the one she bought last year but in black and they don't seem to have it this year so I was hoping to get her another one but in a size down because she's lost so much weight or two sizes down but it's not here in black so we'll just have to keep an eye out i'll wear that one so i can't wear it anymore <laughs> so in that corner from the ride exit you've got a lot of like frozen stuff which is mostly kids based and then there's a section for like home some clothes I like that t-shirt Ooh, it's like one of them tea bag things, isn't it? Oh, yeah. With the Norway on. I like that. Oh, look at Norwegian Minnie. She is cute. 
So how much for some Norwegian top chocolate? Twelve ninety nine. We just got done in the Norway shop, and the ride time for Frozen has gone to ninety minutes now. There's no way. As much as I absolutely love that ride, I'm going to stand there for ninety minutes in this heat. Thank you, Vicky, for the Genie Plus today. You're welcome. Just at the Mexican area, we might as well pop inside and go on the Grand Fiesta tour. <laughs> Vicky, I think you're ruining the good music in the background. <laughs> you fool. <laughs> mental busy in there wasn't it you couldn't move in there but we did manage to move a little bit for Vicky to play her instruments <laughs> okay so two of Vicky's favorite things is Iron Man and Mickey and this t-shirt is them together oh so please try it on Vicky that's amazing oh my I love it okay get it off we can buy that how much is it oh here let me have a this is a mirror. Thirty nine ninety nine. Oh my god! What is this? You look well good in that. Oh, it's got like the Disney Disney Hundred Marvel on the back. Turn around because it's got something on the front as well. It's got what does it say? Disney One Hundred. What if Mickey was the Invincible Iron Man? We call I call Vicky Iron Mouse. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's that's amazing! You have to get that. So there's these shields in this shop. So that one is 139.99. That one is 450, and that one's 400. And oh, it's 450 with the carry case. That one above. They are the boxes are huge. I'm not sure I'd get them back, but they are amazing. I've never seen this lounge fly bag. Look at it. It's got that Iron Man logo on that Vicky's just brought. Captain Marvel Mini. Oh my God, look at all these characters. That is cool. Oh my goodness. This is a lounge fly, Vicky. Hulk is, oh my goodness. That is amazing. How much is that bag? Oh my, that is, that is amazing. That just makes me think of Vicky now every time I look at it. Which, which one's Spider-Man? Spider-Man, Mickey. Spider-Mouse. They're all Mickey really, apart from Minnie there. Oh my, that, that is incredible. Look at Goofy as a hook. Oh my. Okay, I do like that lounge fly. Lots and lots of marvel in here. This shop's one of the best. Oh, Avenger shorts. They're like cycling short material. They're like gym shorts with like. Oh, they've got cycling shorts underneath. Yeah, but it's just like all the characters' names in there. That's really cool. really cool. They're really cool, then. They'd go with your t shirt quite well. Purchase! She got a t-shirt she wanted. So that was in Disney Traders, just opposite World Showcase, like as you come in. The entrance of the World Showcase, yeah. But I've not seen that top all trip, so that shows that- If you see it, buy, buy it. it. And also, like, you do need to go in every shop, because every shop's different. You do. Just an excuse. <laughs> She's buzzing about that, aren't you? I can't wait to wear this. So we're just gonna go for a little walk through the creation shop on our way to get some food. So I think we're just going to get a burger or something because that's what Emma fancies and I'm not going to say no to any Disney fries. I know we've eaten plenty around the uh, World Showcase but I wanted me to eat eat like a proper meal rather than just picking this, picking that. So I'm a bit peckish for something proper. So we're going to munch around the creation shop first to see if we can find anything else to buy. <laughs> Oh, 
Give it a swirl. Oh, look. A bit of Remy, Ola, Big Man, Big Man. Oh, my. That's really cool, that one, isn't it? Not seen that before. That must be new. There's a cool t shirt in this Epcot design, but it's got no Remy on. And I wanted it in the spirit jersey because it had Remy on. I do have a beautiful Dooney and Burke bag though. Oh my, that is a bit nice. How much is that one, Vicky? They're 268. So this Dooney and Burke bag is 268 dollars. Really nice that. Ooh, they're really pretty ears. I'm liking this theming. This is really nice. Mm. This shop is monstrous, isn't it? So this is like an ornament. I'd put it on the Christmas tree. That is beautiful. It's the 100 year collection. It's not too heavy. Chippendale. This glass bauble. I'd be so scared to take it home, but it is stunning. So we're just in Connections Cafe. We ordered one thing of pizza and some fries. However, they However, give us two sets of pizzas. I think the lady read two there and thought it was two pizzas. So, thanks Disney. Pizza. Give it a try, Vic. They're huge slices. I'm never, we're never going to eat all that. We was happy with one piece each. Mm. Good pizza. So that pizza was really nice. Oh, bang it. I mean, I'm pizzaed out for the trip now. That's that's me and pizza done. I'm sure you'll have plenty more though, won't you? Oh yeah, me and pizza are like that. <laughs> oh, so it's 31 degrees right now. It might be overcast, but it's 31 degrees and feels like 35, the app said. And it's 70% humidity. Yeah, so it's a bit sweaty. Yeah, it doesn't look very warm, but honestly, it really is. So, we've got a fast pass for soaring. So we're just going there now, and then, and then we've got one for frozen at some point, but I can't remember what time Quartz that is. Quarter past three, I had a look. So we'll see what time it is when we get off this ride. I think we're meeting up with our friends again in the middle of that, aren't we? Yeah. So I'm looking forward to that. And then more rides. And more food. Probably. We just bumped into Nick, Vera and Lee in the queue. They're in the standby queue. We're in the Genie Plus queue. Losers. So see you next time. <laughs> we'll see you in a future queue. So Soarin's now switched to Soarin over California. It's on for a really short period, hence why it's a 45 minute queue. That's why we got Genie Plus today, because we wanted to get on it. Yeah, which we did. Soarin to tower, we are ready for takeoff. The, I original. the original one. Oh, I'm glad we think the same. I don't think the sequence change was as slick as no, it, you just, you're in one place and then another quickly and I don't know. It was yeah. really good, don't get me wrong, we're just being critical of it. But it's, it, it was good, but it wasn't as slick as the other one. The smells were amazing. And I do think like the vision of like, so when you go into Disneyland at the end. Oh yeah, it was just so quick and over. Yeah, and it wasn't, the picture wasn't very clear. No, but it was, nevertheless, it was really good. But I prefer the old one. So just walking over to Norway now for? 
frozen. Let it go. Let it go. Shh, shh. Don't give him any awake. <laughs> so we're just going over to Frozen for our happily ever. No. Going to Frozen for some ride call. Right, anyway. We're just going over to Frozen for our lightning lane. And then meeting back up with our friends that are in Disney. Yeah, because we'll, we'll have done the majority of stuff. We can't get a lightning lane for test track, which was the only other lightning lane we'd get. Yeah, everything else has got little time, so we don't we don't need to worry about lightning lanes. It was just getting the main ones out of the way, wasn't it? Yeah. And then there's somewhere or in the passport for or the food and wine, which we've found, which looks really cool, which we need to find. We need to find the booth, don't we? Emma has found some kind of cake, chocolatey cake thing, and there's some salt caramel ice cream for me, so. We need to find them after. So let's get over to that ride. And get some ice cream. So we're here for the lightning lane at Frozen Ever After. The standby wait is 75 minutes, Vicky. Ooh. Do you want to build a snowman? Thank you. this Vicky. Okay. So we're at World Showcase. Vic, what have they got that you want? Sort of caramel ice cream. And a nitro Mickey cake pop for me. Yeah. Oh, I'm excited about this. It looks really good. So the, the liquid nitro cake pop was four seventy five, and the salted caramel soft serve was six dollars. So only ten seventy five, which isn't too bad. Oh look, he's making a, one of them pops right now. Oh my, this looks so good, doesn't it? <laughs> it's basically just turning it into an ice cream straight away, isn't it? Whoa, that is pretty cool. Yeah, that's smart. Good. Yeah, it's cool. I'm excited for it. Oh my god, that's so good. Oh my god, that is so good. <laughs> that is so good. I think I might have found my favourite thing. <laughs> is it that, that good? A bloody thimble. Nick's gone for a beer to refresh himself. I've come back with like a kid's portion. <laughs> Good. Oh, I definitely need a pint. It's so cold. It's nice and refreshing. So we've just come out the park and we're headed with Nick and Lee over to Caribbean and Riviera. We're going on the Skyliner, which we've not been on this trip actually. But oh my god, that nitro cake pot was divine. I will have one of them again before we go.
Caribbean, so it'll be good to resort hop see these hotels and get jealous of not staying in them probably. This is cool. Oh wow, this Riviera. You see it on vlogs, but oh my god, it is massive, this hotel. This has got all a French theme to it, this hotel. And I believe it's DVC only. This is a bit grand in here. Oh wow. It's a reception of it. A shop. Oh, a coffee shop. The smell in here. I've just been told it's called Black Tie by Boats. So we can go and get that scent to burn at home. Need that. Just popped into the shop and look at these Riviera cases. I've just seen the most beautiful lounge fly bag. The Riviera Resort one. That is stunning. And they've got some ears. As much as I'd like it, I will only ever buy a bag if I've stayed here. It's beautiful. Oh my! It's Donald in his little art outfit. And Daisy! So cute. There's all the DVC stuff in the shop. It's so cool. Why are the kids stuff so good? Why can't the kids stuff be an adult size? That is one big mug. If I was a DVC member, I'd want that license plate holder. Oh my. Oh my. Dooney and Burke bag for the Riviera. We just sat chilling in the reception. What do you think? It's small. It's very small. For the size of the hotel, it is, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Yeah. Just leaving the Riviera, we're going to walk over to the Caribbean and it's just started spitting. So, are we going to get caught down? caught in a downpour quite possibly oh well it's all good fun oh it's very grey up there it's the Caribbean over there so it's quite close to the Riviera bye bye Riviera we're in the Caribbean with a thunderstorm so I've borrowed Lee's poncho because we got stuck in the uh, rain walking over here but but now we are fully stuck here look at this oh my god no <laughs> oh wow i think we're going to be here for a short while yet <laughs> it's pounding it down out there oh there's some lightning out there go on let's hear it Hi, <laughs> so thunder. I don't think the say this. this thunder is not giving up. I love Florida. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, this is amazing, isn't it, Vicky? Yeah. We're at Caribbean, and they're really great at giving you towels in the entrance. Oh, Ooh, come on! The Seeing the lightning. Black come on! Yeah. Oh, that was disappointing. There we go. That wasn't as big as the last one. <laughs> this is to that! Bring it on. This is a full on tropical storm. So for the last few nights, every night at this time, it's got this. <laughs> this is epic. This is like no thunder I've ever been in. It's literally above us right here. I'd say this is one of the best tropical storms I've been in at Florida. Oh, oh my god, that's amazing! <laughs> this is unreal. Oh, there's another flash. Listen. This is amazing. God, it's getting better. It's getting heavier. I didn't actually think it was. Oh my God, listen to that. <laughs> oh my God. It's like 
the wind is going sideways now. Oh my god, it's getting heavier. I don't think it can get any worse. Oh my god, look at it coming out of that. Come on, thunder. Yeah, yeah, and again, and again, and again. This is unreal, this is. Okay, so we're underneath the uh, shelter, but it is coming in. <laughs> that is the guttering. Oh my. I think it's a bit too late for that. It's coming in, isn't it? <laughs> We're going on a bus. So we walked from, when the rain stopped, we walked from the Caribbean beach to Riviera, got to the Skyliner and realised well, it's we're, not running. Yeah, Caribbean. So we're going to go and get on a bus at the front of every area and go back to Epcot for the cars and to collect our artwork. So first Disney bus of the trip. So because the Skyline is not working, we're getting the Epcot bus back to Epcot. Right guys, we're back at Epcot. We got the bus back and now it's chucking it down again. But we bought some artwork earlier in the American Pavilion. So we need to go pick it up. So we're going to have to go get sucked to go pick it up. So it's like the other side of the park. So we've got to the entrance, we've got to go to the other side of the park, get drenched, pick the artwork up, come all the way back to the entrance to go to the car. Oh, this is going to be fun. This is like a water ride, basically. Yeah, but on a, on a good note, yeah, football looks really pretty. <laughs> There's a, a music show going on it right now. Beautiful. Right, let's so, go. Let's get wet. going well for us at all. We've made it a quarter of the way around the World Showcase. Well, we've made it to Mexico. I mean, from, from the entrance of the Probably back. not a quarter of the way, but... And now the rain's going heavy again, so we took cover. <laughs> this is quite fun, though. It's yeah. quite an adventure, isn't it? But we're getting very wet. But we need to get to America and back. Wish us luck, please. Oh, no! I want the fireworks. Oh, my. I don't think we're safe under the shelter. Oh my. It's coming down. Are you ready, Vicky? Right, so we're just in caramel cuche. We've just stopped to get out of the rain, but also Vicky wants a snack. So everything here is wherever original flavour. Ooh. I'm torn between two. Let me uh, go on then, tell us. The butter bar. Yeah. Or the milk chocolate caramel square. Oh, I think I like the look of the milk chocolate caramel square. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Decisions the cookies look good. Right, so what'd you pick? The uh, milk chocolate caramel square with sea salt on the top. Give it a try. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's solid, is it? Let's have a look. Mmm. How is it? Good? Mm -mm. It's not something I'd eat, but that means you get more of it. So, actually, looks like it's slowing down a little bit. It's probably spoke too soon, but we'll try and get out in it again. Just doing a little rain dance. So that's where the Eat to the Beat concert is. It's 98 degrees. I don't know who they are myself, but maybe somebody does. But we've made it to America. It's just there, so we can pick up our artwork. We made it, the artwork's safe. The rain is slowing, isn't it? My part is that wet in here. Well, we need to make it back now, the other way around the world, and to the car. Oh. Let's see how long that takes, and if it gets any worse, eh? So I've just stopped in the British Pavilion, and it's quite comical seeing like the underground <laughs> stuff. This London uh, hoodie is quite cool actually with yeah. Mickey Mouse on. Quite like that. Oh, the London Mickey and Minnie t shirt's really cool. It's quite interesting coming in your own pavilion to see. Yeah. 
So we're in the British, uh, in the UK pavilion, and there's a Mars bar. Come on, Vicky, tell me how much a Mars bar is. $3.45. Oh. I thought it would be more. Wine gum, uh, fruit gums, how much are these? $6.95. Oh. Let's find some more chocolate. This is fun. There's a Terry's chocolate I orange around there. So £1.50 in England. I mean, sometimes if you're lucky, you can get two packs for a quid at not anymore. Inflation. <laughs> Please tell me. Please tell me this hair is chocolate orange. Nine ninety-nine. Inflation. Haven't even got the real proper Jeff kits. So the it's shocking. The two car two looks of caramel bars. What, like one pound fifty? Five. Don't buy chocolate. I mean, it is amazing chocolate, oh, cool. British chocolate compared to American chocolate. Sorry, America. However, it's expensive. So we just had a quick trip to Walmart. We didn't really get much, did we? No, just a few bits of pop, some more sachets for putting in the water, um, as in the flavoured sachets. Got some cookies and just uh, some more Mountain Dew, some bits and bobs. Yeah, not much. Now we're gonna go to McDonald's, I think, for some food, because we're tired and hungry. So I'm broken. Emma's I'm broke. absolutely broken. I can't even walk properly anymore. It's not all right. This. I'm broken. Are you not broken? I can still keep going. <sighs> so Disney. We're, we're going back to All Stars movie. Uh, all Stars music. I can't even speak. I'm that broken. We're going to go back and stop at McDonald's, which is just right outside the All Stars resort. Qu grab a quick burger and bed. So we'll so, see you back. See you in the room. So we've just got to McDonald's, this is the one right opposite, so if you just head down that way, down there, you can see that sign, that's the all-star resort, so it's literally right next door. So we're just going to quickly grab some food from in here, I shall show you inside. It's quite cool outside with all these lights, little canopy area. Oh, another Disney day done, I can't believe it. It's going too fast. Oh no, it's real sad. But it has been an incredible day. Yeah, we've done so much today. Yeah. We've done like 90% of it, I'd say. Genie Plus, ate around the world. Did loads of rides, caught in a storm. Oh, that storm was amazing. That was mint. That was the best tropical storm we've ever been in, and we've been in quite a few. It was so close, it was like right above our heads, it oh, was that close. Yeah, and we've been with friends today, which again has just been incredible to share it with them. What else? We've been to Walmart. McDonald's. Oh, we've just done loads. Go on, how many steps we've done today? 26 or 27,000. We've done, we've been up 17 hours. So another busy day. Yeah, an incredible one, an incredible one. That's the way we like it though. Yeah, full on and loved every minute. We've not wasted a second at all today. So thank you for watching. We really appreciate it. If you wanna like, comment and subscribe. And we've got some really cool, fun stuff coming up in the next few days. So oh, yeah. stay watching. So we'll see you real soon. Good night. Bye.